All right, so we've got a video showing uh, this is this is the aircraft basically in the travel mode. Uh, we have the legs already attached, but we're going to install the system, and, and I'll talk you through that. So. So when you when you set it up, um, you typically this is on the ground there in the field. You're going to raise the antennas. You're going to raise your TrueView GNSS antenna and then lock that into place. Make sure all these are secured. Uh, don't want these moving around during flight. So then you're going to raise each M600 arm and then lock that into place. So you should feel a slight click. So there's a detent there on each arm when you rotate that locking mechanism you should feel it uh, lock into place you want to make sure all of these are secure so then you're going to remove each uh, so each propeller each arm has a uh, prop cover so just make sure you remove that prop cover and straighten out the propellers they don't have to be perfect but just get them close minimizes vibration on that initial startup. So then you're gonna attach your GNSS antenna, it's located in the tree view case. Be sure that that is secure. So if that, that comes loose, if you're not removing your antenna between flights and this gets loose, uh, it could cause a disconnect and, and then you'll miss out, uh, You'll lose GNSS signal during flight and you won't be able to recover that data. And so then you're gonna install your, your controller box. And then the TreeView system just slides in that dovetail from the sides to just make sure it's flush with the sides of the Ronin mount there and then turn that locking mechanism. And make sure you attach your safety lanyard. So this is going to be through the aluminum bracket and then through the aircraft frame. Last step is connecting the GNSS antenna cable. This goes from our, our antenna on top down to the TreeView system. And then you plug in your CAT6 cable, which connects to the controller on top uh, to the TreeView system. And then you want to remove the lens cover. So we provide this red flag on, on the uh, lens cover. So if you see that during takeoff, you want to land and <laughs> make sure you're removing those before you take off. Uh, check the battery status light there. So then insert your battery. And then connect your uh, USB drive. All right. So that is the uh, hardware component installations is uh, depending on on how you um, disassemble your aircraft during travel um, you know you'll need to go in through this process there in the field before you before you begin flight